Hey Stone Ridge, welcome to Timberwolf TV, where we make lemonade out of lemons. And let me just tell you a little funny thing. This year I was like, do I change my little tagline, lemonade out of lemons? Because like, this year's gonna be great, it's gonna be perfect. Well, this week I decided I chose the right tagline to continue using because I've been making a lot of lemonade this week. And let me tell you about these ingredients I'm using for this lemonade. First, we have like the most ridiculous temperatures ever recorded ever. So we, we took that and then we're like, okay, cool, we got this, we're fine. And then let's add some really terrible air quality to that. And okay, cool, still rocking and rolling, still positive, still smiling. And then this morning, we just have this like fun, let's call it an, an ice cube for our lemonade. A, a nice, uh, we had a friend out front this morning that, um, you know, just added a little excitement for us. So anyway, we had, we still had a great day. We made it, no big deal. And thank you to all of you um, for being awesome. And that's all I have to say. I really I always say that this uh, community is amazing. Um, you were all so positive in your emails to me and um, very, if you happen to be part of things this morning, you were so you just like took action and helped and and thank you that's all i have to say so anyway uh up here on the ridge we're still making lemonade and we're good at it so we'll keep doing it uh let's see what we have so first last night was our first ptc meeting and there were some new faces there please please come just come to a meeting check it out meet the people they're so welcoming and um, I just want you to be able to feel like you're part of what's happening and knowing what's happening and having a voice. So I would love to see you at the next meeting. And so that brings me to our next thing, which is a huge event coming to support Stone Ridge and it's our Jogathon. And if you are new, Jogathon is like the big thing Stone Ridge is known for. And why? Because Stone Ridge has been able to put on a jogathon on their own with their own people um, like nobody else in the entire district. And this year we're gonna do it again. It's been a few years we haven't been able to do that, but this year we're doing it again. Um, other schools need outside people to help them. They don't bring in you know, the same funds, all that stuff, but Stone Ridge does a jogathon and we do it well. And so we're very excited, but it can happen if we don't have support. So I know that a ton of you are gonna come on the day and help with it, and so we know we can count on that, and that's awesome. But right now, we have four core PTC people who are basically doing too much. <laughs> They're just doing pretty much everything, and we need some other people to help. So if you feel like you can do some of the behind the scenes, just planning work, please email me, email the PTC, tell your teacher anything. Um, we could just really use some extra hands on, on all the events that we're doing. And we wanna do some really fun things this year. I just feel like the whole vibe has been different since the beginning when we're having people involved and doing the fun things. And so we wanna continue that. So that's just my plea for you, okay? And um, so speaking of JOG, let's talk about some of the things that you can look for that are gonna happen. Um, whether you're helping or not, on Monday, you're gonna get an email from 99 laps. I think it's 99 laps, it's 99 something. And um, it, it says your sponsor page, it's your child sponsor page. And you just set it up real quick. And then you just send, just put emails of it, people you know, and it will send them an email. It's just, it's gonna let the people know it's a legit and not a dollar, not a cent is taken from our school. Whatever is donated comes to us. We are very careful about doing that. So um, encourage those donations to go through there. Super easy, no problem. We also will take cash and checks and all of that, but um, I just want you to know that that's coming. Um, what else? Speaking of parents and how awesome you are, let's just continue on with that. So many of you have been helping at lunch and we cannot do it without you. I am beyond appreciative of your help and we're gonna continue doing that um, unless you would like to work at lunch for us every day. I'm having a really hard time finding people to commit to that one hour time slot in the middle of the day. So um, if you feel like you wanna get paid for like when you can, we can do that. If you wanna be every day, we can do that. Let me know, but it, but uh, regardless, we're gonna keep up the signups 
for lunch help until I have people that I know will be here every day. So thank you for helping, like especially in these days when we cannot go out at lunch. I am so thankful for you who are here helping us and put extra bodies in the classroom. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, and it has been awesome. I don't think that's all. I think that's all I have right now. Um, have a wonderful weekend. There's, I have never been so excited for a break in the temperature. It's supposed to happen tomorrow. Um, and as much as I, I don't like the air quality that we are dealing with, I'm also thankful that we live where we do and we're not affected directly by the fires. Those fires are very close to home. They do affect people we know in our community, um, students, teachers, spouses, like they work with the fire. So just be thinking positive thoughts that we can get a handle on it and, and get it turned around. So um, all I want to say is have a wonderful weekend. We'll see you on Monday. It's going to be a new week and um, I just hope we're making a little less lemonade, but we'll still be smiling. Have a great weekend. Thank you for watching Timberwolf TV where we make lemonade out of lemons.